let's see what an equation is we know what this sign is this is an equal sign that means whatever is on the left side of this sign is equal to the things on the right hand side of this sign an equation shows that the number on the left or the expression on the left is equal to the number or the expression on the right we already know that algebra is like solving a puzzle so if i write like this x plus 10 equals 15 this is called as an equation this tells me that x plus 10 has the same value as that of the number 15 and the puzzle here is that we need to find out the value of x that means basically what we are doing we are finding out the missing number or we are finding out the mystery number using an equation now how do i find the value of x this particular example here is quite easy what we are going to do here is that we are going to learn a method to solve such equations so that when the equation is not this easy then also we should be able to solve it so what is the first step the first step is to isolate the variable that is x what does isolate mean isolate mean leave it alone leave it on its own what i mean is that if on the left hand side we have only x then whatever is on the right hand side that's the value of x so by some method if i can isolate x if i can leave it alone on the left hand side then it is very easy to know its value because whatever is on the right hand side that will be the value of x so if i want to isolate x what i need to do i need to get rid of plus 10 now how do i get rid of plus 10 we do an inverse operation that means we do the opposite thing what is the opposite thing of plus 10 minus 10 so if i put minus 10 after plus 10 then i am doing an opposite operation before we go further let's think of an equation as a balance when you are working on an equation what you need to do is you always need to keep things in balance here is an example now what i have here is 10 minus 1 equals 3 multiplied by 3 this is an equation and this is in balance because the value on the left hand side is 9 10 minus 1 and the value on the right hand side is also 9 the operations performed on both the sides are different but the value is the same the value is 9 now suppose if i add 10 on the left hand side what will happen the left hand side value would be 19 because 9 plus 10 gives me 19 and the right hand side would still be 9 that means now the left hand side is heavy so if i want to keep things in balance again what i need to do i need to add 10 on the right hand side also if i do that then the value of the left hand side is also 19 and of the right hand side is also 19 that means i am again in balance this is an important thing we need to remember when we solve an equation the important thing is whatever you do on the left hand side you need to do it on the right hand side also that means do your operations to both sides okay so let's go back to our original problem what we have done here to isolate x we have subtracted 10 from the left hand side now we know that we need to do the same thing on the right hand side so let's subtract 10 from 15 so what we get here is x plus 0 equals 5 because 15 minus 10 is 5 
and on the left hand side plus 10 minus 10 means nothing that it is as good as adding 0 or doing nothing that means my answer is x equals 5 this is how we solve an equation we first isolate the variable to isolate the variable we do some inverse operation and whatever operation we do on one side the same operation we do on the other side also and this is how you get the value of the variable let's solve one more puzzle x minus 6 equals 16 again we need to isolate x to isolate x let's do an inverse operation so inverse of minus 6 is plus 6 so we add 6 on the left hand side to keep the balance let's do the same thing on the right hand side so we get 16 plus 6 16 plus 6 is 22 that means x equals 22